हेलो आप देख रहे हैं फर्स्ट इंडिया फिल्म में मैं हूं आपकी होस्ट एंड दोस्त रजनी प्रियंका चोपड़ा के बाद रिचर्ड मैडेन भी मुंबई पहुंच चुके हैं अपनी वेब सीरीज सिटाडेल के प्रीमियर के लिए और इसी सिलसिले में आज एक प्रेस कॉन्फ्रेंस रखी गई जहां पर प्रियंका चोपड़ा ने अपने आने वाले शो के बारे में कई खुलासे किए Also, because it's 2023, we're going to go with men first. You okay with that? All right. Thank you so much. What would you love to do in your first time in India? And have you been given any tips already by the homegrown superstar, Priyanka? I mean, there's lots of things I want to do. We've not had a chance to actually talk about it. I need oh. all your top tips and recommendations. Well, Richard has no time to do anything. First of all, I'll tell you, he has a really <laughs> packed schedule. I'm at least trying to get him to have coconut from coconut water. Did I, I sent it to your room? Did you get it yet? God damn it! Somebody send this man a coconut. <laughs> um, but um, I don't think he has enough time. But there's so many amazing things to see, and, and he knows that. I really wanted to go to the national park. I was like, I'm going to go running, and it's like, no, there's lots of tigers. Don't. Yeah, do I don't think you have time to go running in the in the park. No, no. <laughs> nice. Thank you so much for that, Priyanka. I mean, you need no introduction, but can I please do this? Because I love you. Yeah, super successful actor, producer, entrepreneur, author. Okay, so all of this. But you also become the first South Asian woman to lead a network TV show in the U.S. And the rest, of course, is history. So congratulations on that. Yes, yes, yes. I'm gonna. Take a step back in time and ask you that moment when you said yes to Citadel, and was there a waiting period or a thinking period before saying that yes? Not for me. <laughs> I was very clear. This conversation started about five years ago, and um, it's taken that long because the show is extremely ambitious, and uh, there was a lot of development that happened, but. What was presented to me by Jen Salki, Jennifer Salki, who's the head of Amazon Studios, was she wanted to create an international, global franchise, which is an original IP, which truly connects the world. So when we talk about diversity, Amazon is very much about diversity, and true diversity is represented internationally, not just with having different skin tones, but hearing the way people speak, actually delving into culture. And this show has the incredible ability to span across every country, every continent. So I didn't even know the story, and I was like, "Yep, doing it." <laughs> Fantastic! Congratulations, Richard. You've of course been part of many successful franchises, uh, many of our favorites, actually. But why did this one set itself apart for you? What were those one or two things that really excited you about becoming Mason Kane? I think the thing that really set it apart from, I suppose, a bunch of other things that I've done is this concept of duality. Mm -hmm. um, not only do we play two characters each, but then having your memory wiped and creating this whole other person. Correct. The idea of that and the the concept of what parts of you are, are built into you as a human and what Correct. bits are learned experience from traumatic childhoods, et cetera, and, and how can we play with that concept of our own humanity? That's what, what really drew me in. Fantastic, thank you for that. The Russo brothers, legends in their own right, right? When it comes to them, mega scale, this sort of cinematic storytelling that we could never imagine, and it's so high impact. So I'm going to take this to both of you. When you had David Whale as the showrunner and executive producer, who's also the creator of another Amazon original, which is The Hunters, uh, could you each tell us your experience of working with these amazing, you know, creators? I mean, it's, what's so brilliant about working with people who have such a huge vision is it allows you as an actor to focus on what you're doing because you're not trying to piece together the whole big picture, these multi-country spanning shows, these intricate storylines. You're allowed to just focus on your job as an actor. So it gives you a real freedom because they have such a huge, large-scale vision. Correct, absolutely. Priyanka, for you? I think they're incredible. Um, working with Joe Anthony and the whole Agbo team, bringing in David, there was such a sense of collaboration that they had with us. They trusted the actors. Um, they asked us questions about you know, our characters, what we thought our characters would do. So there was this incredible 
trust and faith which we ab absolutely had in them because of you know their credibility but they showed in us as well so when you walk onto set it was never a us and you thing it was a all of us together creating the show so we feel a sense of ownership and we feel a sense of belonging because it's ours because we put in they helped us they encouraged us to protect our characters they encouraged us to talk about our characters and i think that made it a really wonderful work experience. I can imagine what a dream come true for anybody who'd like to tell big stories and that's you. Streaming of course has changed the way we look at stories, right guys? I think this is an accepted fact now. Like Prime Video has been at the forefront of that evolution. Do you think a story like Citadel with this kick ass, if I may say that action, okay I'm going off script here, grand scale and at the same time there's this emotional core which I think is going to have that sort of connect with audiences all across the world. Do you think that that's why this makes it a perfect fit for Prime Video? I think so. I think Prime Video is um, tremendously global and they um, have a quest to make sure that they touch diversity across the world and they tell stories and hyper-specific stories from around the world and connect people just the way streaming has connected the world. So I think this show is not just a perfect fit for Prime, but I think it, it could only be done on Amazon Prime because they're the only streamer that connects the world in such a detailed way. Fantastic. Richard, would you like to add to that? All right. Could you tell us a little bit more about your characters? Because now we've seen Nadia and Mason. Okay, but what is surprising about them and what are the parts that you personally found intriguing? Now you start last time. That's what. We're okay. doing this in turns, man. Um, uh, what I find intriguing about them is, 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 is how, how damaged they must be in certain ways in order to choose this kind of life. And I think that's something we kind of got to explore with both of them and, and hopefully we'll have more opportunity too is delving into who they are. To be someone who is being someone else every day and on top of that then playing another character all at once these are really complicated, intricate humans who do kill people, who do bad things, who have questionable moral judgment. They're, um, they're complicated humans. Nice. Priyanka? Um, I think he really encapsulated what our characters do. I think um, Mason's character comes from a place of really trying to understand his past and who he is as a person today. And I think Nadia is who she is today and what she's going to be in the future. And they kind of are star-crossed. They kind of Correct. are drawn to each other no matter what happens. Um, and there's, you know, outside of all the flashy action and the, you know, big stunts and the explosion mm -hmm. and all that cool stuff, the show has so much heart because their characters can't stop but be drawn to each other. You know, our characters, their characters, our characters. Um, and I think that just makes for like good TV, you know, like you, you invested in, in both Nadia and Mason. At least that's what I felt when I watched the whole show. बता दें प्रियंका चोपड़ा और रिचर्ड इस शो में एक जासूस एजेंट की भूमिका में नजर आने वाले हैं। वेल well, सीरीज के ट्रेलर को काफी अच्छा रिस्पांस मिल रहा है और लोग बेसब्री से इंतजार कर रहे हैं इसके रिलीज होने का। वेल well, आप भी कितने एक्साइटेड हैं हमें कमेंट बॉक्स में जाकर कमेंट करके जरूर बताएं। चैनल को लाइक,